It's the Kyle and Jackie O Show this morning here at Kiss FM. Uh, we promised you we'd get Gaga on the phone. Yes, and uh, here she is. Hello. She's joining us now. Good Hi, morning. Lady hey, Gaga. Hun, how are you? How are you? I'm so happy to talk to you. I feel like it's been so long. It has. <laughs> it has it been has. so long. I well, feel like it's been quite a few years. It was before your last, uh, like, last album, well, was she, it? Well, she can't just spend her life ringing radio stations around the world. The girl's got to live a life. <laughs> She's got to entertain everyone. There's concerts. Wait there's albums. What, 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 what? I can spend my life the way I want to, and I want to call Kyle and Jackie Fair enough. <laughs> I'll stand Talk corrected. about music. <laughs> We're loving the new you? song. Yeah, we're great. Well. Yeah. yeah, oh, awesome. Really awesome. good. Uh, obviously, the new song, Stupid Love, you put that out just before our Mardi Gras, so we oh. went crazy. Oh, the gays were yeah. sucking it up. They loved it. Oh, well, I love the gays. You know that. Yes. So, yeah, that makes me very happy. Yeah. yeah. I think everywhere you go, it was getting blasted on that first night. It's it saturated within the first weekend of its release yeah. in Australia. It was awesome. That's wonderful. You know, I think, like, you know, you know, Pride and Mardi Gras and the LGBTQ plus community is it's like always held such a special place in my heart. And it, it just means a lot to me that when I put out music, they, you know, always seem to rally around me and my message. And I really wanted with Stupid Love to put a sense of positivity in the world and remind people that we have love and that it's the most beautiful thing that we have and that kindness still exist, even though things, you know, don't always feel easy and can feel really hard. It, I think it's really great to feel grateful for what we do have, and yeah. like, love is one of those things. And love is a stupid thing because, like, it, it gets a hold of you. No, it makes you do and, crazy and, things, uh, right? love makes you do crazy-ass things. You know, I, I agree, Jackie. It can make you, I think, I mean, what do you guys think? I think love can make all of us crazy in some types of ways, you know? It, it makes us do stupid things, say stupid things, but also... You know, the way that I use the word stupid in the song, is it's also meant to kind of be in a little bit of a childlike way. Like, I just I just want your stupid love. Yeah. Like, <laughs> I could I could say this and, 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 like with a lot of poetry and I could run around in circles and I could check your Instagram or whatever <laughs> other social media platform you're, you're on and I could stalk you. But actually, <laughs> I just want your stupid love. And I feel like there's a lot of walls around you that are preventing this from happening. Please. <laughs> Let's, let's let's just try, you know, and I, that's part of where the song came from. And like, how do we free ourselves? And for me, it was just extremely personal. Like, how could I free myself from all the things that I felt were chaining me from being able to be free and fall in love and what was in the way and, you know, what what's in the way for other people? So I thought about not just me when I was writing this record. I, I thought about the world and, you know, I, I really love the world and I really want the, the world to feel love from me every time I put out music. I think I wonder, I think every time someone falls in love, like it's different, right? It's, it's not the same sort of pattern, same sort of feeling. Like I really love you know, kissing someone new and, so, you know, I, sometimes I do that it's every weekend. It's called the honeymoon you know. period. That's time. right, Jackie, yeah. And Jackie, it's where you get the butterflies. Jackie's in a lull now, stuff. Gaga. She's in a big lull. It's like she's <laughs> sitting in this big hole. There's no love around. There's nothing it's, There's nothing on the horizon. That no one's even looking her way. It's a well, ri- I love you, Jackie. <laughs> I love like... you. And, and you know what? It's going to happen. Just when you, it, it's like I don't, I don't you make promises so you, you know, can't keep, like, Gaga. When you least expect it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm okay for now. Don't listen to Kyle. I'm all good. Uh, uh, well, I'm telling the truth. That's all. How? Listen, yeah, but you know what? Like, that's what the song's about, though. You know, like I was, I was single, and I, I wrote the lyrics. Now, now it's time to free me from the shame. I've got to find that peace. Is it too late? Or could this love protect me from the pain? I would battle for you, even if we break in two. I freak out. Look at me. All we ever wanted was love. I want you to love. It's very direct and it's very simple. And actually, Jackie, it's completely okay that you feel that way. Like, yeah. I would just like to say that, you know, on behalf of every single woman, that it's okay to want love yeah. and it's okay to <laughs> say that you do. Listen, can you write a new song just like looking for dick? Because that's pretty much what she's doing. I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you should... yeah. <laughs> but so true, nonetheless. No, it's not. Listen, just because just because we want love doesn't mean that we're all hoes, okay? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I love talking to you. Last time you did ring us, you were in the studio. You played staff, and you were right. In the, we sort of caught you right in the zone 
of you doing what you do best, like right in the studio there. Uh, you love it in the studio. Are you, a, are you a studio lover or do you love the touring? Do you love being on stage in front of people? I love the studio. I'm actually in my home studio right now um, in California, and I made the majority of this record in the studio that I'm sitting in right this second, and it was actually... It was a really hard process for me because I, I was going through a, a time in my life that, you know, we were just saying, you know, that Jackie might may have been going through too, but I was actually having a lot of trouble with it, Jackie. Like, I did not like being single. Um, I felt like my career had kind of taken over everything and that my personal life was something that I didn't get to have as much, you know, time to pursue and have control over. And you know, I got very sad and it wasn't just about that. I had, I had other, other things in my life and other traumas that were hard for me, but mm. blood pop, my producer would come up into my kitchen and he would go, come on, we're going to go write a song, and, you know, either be crying or being like, I don't know. I don't I'm like, I'm just going to write something sad. And he'd go, come on, let's go. We're going to go write some music. And you know what? He played me either a track that he'd been working on or I'd sit down at the piano and I would start writing chords or poetry. And it was amazing that I actually ended up writing really happy celebratory music, even though I was down and it showed me how strong I was. Wow. And then eventually I became strong enough to kind of like let go. And like, it turns out that when I put my mind to making music, that it freed me, I made celebratory music and it made me not only make a song that now is like really big all over the world. And I'm so proud, but it also made, you know, me open for a place where I could fall in love. And, you know, I think that like opening your heart, like in that way, is very difficult and it's scary. And I have wonderful friends around me and creative people that help me do it. And I love them all so much. So a shout out to blood pop too. on the radio. (laughs) I love blood pop. Oh, I love them. Um, Lady Gaga, how are you going with the coronavirus? Celebrities are all reacting in different ways. Some, like Naomi Campbell, are covered head to toe and others just are carrying on as normal. How's it for you? Uh, you know, all I can really say about the coronavirus truly is that I just extend my heart and my wishes out to anyone that's suffering or anyone that's lost anyone to the coronavirus or that, you know, is afraid of, of you know, getting it, you know, I, I think what is difficult about this is that it's asymptomatic, which means that you can get it without knowing that someone has symptoms. And I, I just wish a lot of like peace in the hearts of people around the world so that we can, you know, all get through this together. And I think kindness is something we should all deploy right now. No, you've got uh, such good, I love your spirit. Your spirit's always awesome. You're always on point. I feel horrible that you were crying in that kitchen because it would be hard for you to find. I look at Jackie and think, look how hard it is for her. Imagine Gaga. Where do you even go? You can't just jump on Tinder. Well, you could, but, you know, that'd be weird. I'm glad you're happy. No, but my girlfriend, it's funny. It's funny you bring that up because I used to go, I can't even date online. And then my girlfriends would be like, trust me, you don't. Too. Yeah, you don't that's want right. To keep away from her. <laughs> I just hear horror stories and think, no, I'm staying away from that. Well, she looks happy now. The uh, Stupid yeah, Love they, Record, that's out. Everything's awesome. Album on the way. Touring, yes, no. You're thinking you. about it. What are you doing? You're thinking, yes, maybe. Yeah, more I'm touring. touring. I'm doing. I'm doing a. I'm doing a, a stadium tour. It's called the Chromatica Ball. Uh, name uh, you, have you have to Chromatica. rename it. Chromatica. Chromatica. Paul's not good with uh, any Spelling. kind of big word. Yeah. Or, can't you yeah. simple it? Can you dumb it down? Like you know, just like Gaga live. That's easier for me. Do I do I ever dumb things down? You never do. Oh, you've, I, just don't you've know actually, that I, I don't know that I do that. You don't. You know, but you've actually helped me learn. Like you've helped me learn big words like Chromatica. Yeah, I'm going to write that down. <laughs> K, what is it? Chromatic is not a, not a real word. <laughs> oh, <laughs> right, forget it. I'm not learning it. Uh, <laughs> look, hon, it's nice to talk to you as always. Uh, oh, you we'll let, will learn it. Yeah, I'll learn it. I'll learn it. I'll learn it. I'll burn it in everyone's brains. Uh, look, uh, can't wait to see you again. Uh, invite me around to that studio. I'd like to you have a look do. at where you create. And um, we'll see you when you get here. Yeah, I, I create in a Frank Zappa's old studio. The, he's a really, really interesting, incredible a uh, rock and roll artist, and wow. uh, I've been working out of his studio for a long time. You're awesome. Oh, beautiful. Oh, nice Thanks, to chat. Honey. We'll Great s- to talk to you. See you again soon. Thank you. I, I can't wait to see you guys. Have a beautiful day. You Hi, too. kisses. There's Gaga, everyone. Lady Gaga, Stupid okay. Love. It's out now. The Kyle and Jackie O Show.